Maybe use these clamps for cutting boards. Or that clamp carrier. Think that one will do some cutting boards? Probably hold doors. Today we're at Defiance Reservoir. It's slippery up here. I'm afraid I'm gonna fall. But there's handicapped parking up at the top. And then there's like a, a whole trail that goes through the woods. And then a full half mile trail or maybe mile all the way around. And you can uh, run and walk on top or on the bottom. That's all paved or stoned. Uh, there's a dock out I think in the summer and you can fish out here I'm not sure how deep it is I'll try to look up all that information and what species of uh, fish are in here come on those aren't Canadian geese Sure, what those are. Big geese. But look over there, there's a giant hill, perfect for sledding. And they do have it lit up at night. Couple gazebos. Well, you can see it's a beautiful day out. Beautiful day to be walking. Can't even go walk on the ice. See if it's thick enough. <laughs> Duke, if you pull me too hard, I'm gonna fall. That's why I'm walking in the grass. Here comes somebody. Ice shanty. He's going. He's going ice fishing. Nope, he turned down that road. We can go back. It literally was not snowing five minutes ago. Was it? So I wanted to... It wasn't even that bad out, but it is ice cold. I don't have the gloves or nothing. Here, you hold this, he's jerking me too much. I do know straight ahead of us is a uh, railroad trap. Nine holes or eighteen holes, but they have frisbee golf. There's, you can see one of the holes down here. Here, take him and I'll show him the hole. That goes all the way. I don't think I locked it. It goes all the way around the rock quarry, and there's a hole down there. Can you see it? Oh, there's two. So these are two straight straightaways. Whoa, that's slippery. See the hole there. Uh, there's a whole way down there. You can see it. But, yeah, see, that's the dock there. That they put at the end of this thing. Let me let her start this. Start it. And they'll put the dock down at the end of this ramp thing. I don't want to go on it because it's probably slippery. I slip right down into my death. That's not water down there. It's ice and rocks. But it's pretty big rock quarry. And I know there are fish in here. Um, I haven't had a lot of luck fishing off the bank. But I think if you took a boat out and a fish finder, you'd probably 
get some fish. Might even be saw guy in there, which saw guy's real close to a walleye. Let's try to get down this incline without sliding to our death. It's all ice. Can we do it? I'm just gonna kind of let it go. Now, if you go back that way, there's a boardwalk that you can go across and a big trail all the way through the woods. And we'll walk that again sometime. Probably not today. Because look what happened. The sun was out. And then, bam! Cold, windy snow out of nowhere. So this is going to be a short one. There wasn't any snow on that hill when we got here. And now you can see a nice little uh, dusting of snow. But wouldn't that make a great hill for sledding, snowboarding? You walk up the less steep part or walk right up the middle and man some of that's like a straight drop off and the other side's a little less of a abrupt angle it looks like they did use it for sledding well yeah and they got lights for it too so. a lot of fun but see you can kind of right there at the top of this lower hill there's a paved path you can run on, and there's signs telling how much distance it is around the entire thing. But then at the top of the mound, there's another rock path that you can walk around. And then we're on the road path right here in front of us. So. Parking all the way at the back and then all the way at the top, but it's not uh, unleashed, so you gotta leash your dogs. Uh, but over here just to the the other side of this actually there's a dog park fenced in dog park that you can let your dogs run around but I think you gotta pay a fee to get them in there like a city fee and I'm not sure where you do that so but the name of the park let's see if we can see it here I can't see it right there at that flagpole right there I don't know what it is though all right see you later right down the road from the quarry is the prop floppers RC club and they fly remote control airplanes and helicopters and whatever out there. So that's the prop floppers. That's right down from the rock quarry in Defiance, Ohio. Then just down the road and Probably the east of it, west of it, of the rock quarry is All Glaze Village. It's an old rustic, uh, they have a farm museum, historic farm set up, and they talk about how the, the way things used to be. And they have a few festivals here, and uh, this is open through the summer. Old railroad crossing, looks like they got a bridge back there, some old trains. So, pretty neat little place if you're in the area. Great place to check out. Especially in the fall, they have a, uh, what's it called? All Glaze Village Harvest Festival? No. Fall Apple Festival. Huh? Fall Festival. Fall Festival, maybe? But yeah, fall time's a great time for All Glaze Village. But you can probably check it out online.
guess that that's the graveyard was there before the railroad. and I just walked down here to show you one thing. I wanted to show you this. Duke, get up here. You're going to get hurt yourself hurt. That right there. Look at that wheat grass. Isn't it gorgeous? He got himself a weasel.